the problem is any job title you create is eventually going to become overloaded, right? It's it's a big problem, but it's not one we're going to solve today or really ever. Well, actually, I we think... will solve it today in, in this. In this. Oh, fantastic! In okay, yeah, Joe, right. Joe has so, the solution. No, <laughs> but, I keep going, Matt. I just... <laughs> but I, I think what I would say is that, like, essentially, analytics engineering is applying a lot of data engineering and software engineering principles to analytics. That's what it is, and so in a sense, it's a type of specialized data engineer. Is what I would describe. It's a subset. It as. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. And, and, you know, and it's, it was the ability, you know, I know this is spearheaded by companies like DBT and so forth, where, um, you know, analytics engineering is really giving an analyst the ability to do engineering things. And so, um, you know, I think that's a, uh, it is a subset of data engineering. I don't see them as being um, very distinct uh, in the sense where if you're, um, I just think like transitively, if you're doing analytics engineering, you eventually start doing data engineering. And then uh, at least it's a progression that I've seen uh, with quite a few people. Um, or if you're a data engineer and you happen to be working on analytics use cases, hey, congratulations, you are probably a uh, analytics engineer. Uh, we'll give you a, a nice badge and stuff to honor your new title. But as Matt says, titles have a weird way of morphing into other things, right? So I think it depends like, what's the zeitgeist as well in which the title exists? Um, you saw this with data science, right? Where everybody wanted to be a data science and every company wanted to hire data scientists. So all of a sudden, conceivably every job under the sun that dealt with data was suddenly a data science role. Historically, that would have been, you know, BI developer or analyst maybe. Uh, but I remember back when analyst was like a four letter word, like you would not want to have that title um, back like 10 years ago. That was a, that's a kiss of death. Right. So, of course, you want to be a data scientist. I, I can remember a lot of data scientist job postings. Then you look at the job posting and it's like, you, you know, you're going to write SQL and you're going to build visualizations. And like, that's your data scientist job. Right. <laughs> right. Um, <laughs> yeah. Sounds like it sounds like a lot of other jobs. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I just realized with titles, it's, it's all silliness at the end of the day. Right. Like you can just give yourself, call yourself whatever you want. I don't care. It's more about what do you accomplish at your job and like, what do you actually do? Right. That's to me, that's what I look at. I could really care less about your title. I really don't care. So, yeah. Some people yeah. do though, you know, it's what they, it's what they work for. It's just to get the title and whatnot. And I, and I understand the value of it. I, I'm just old and unemployed, so it doesn't matter. So, <laughs> yeah. It's I mean, hard I, being I would, unemployed. Yeah. I, I would say, you know, when it comes to the titles, like my, my, I, I would just be very mercenary about it. Like what title is going to help you get the biggest paycheck right now? And like, don't get emotionally attached to them. Right. Like just if calling yourself an like, analytics engineer will get you an extra 15 K, uh, you know, then, then you're an analytics yeah. engineer. 